What is going on guys today we have got another objective in one to watch or ones to watch warm up so strap yourself in because we've got some lengthy descriptions again whoever is hired at EA to do these they are liking this essays recently so we get a jumbo rare players pack to finish this already big fan I like that they're doing this we've got the team of the week warm up we've got the one to watch I like that they're giving us some different milestones I think personally it was something that a lot of people have suggested over the years that they need to do a bit more than just the weekly. Yes, you don't necessarily need more weekly stuff, but long term, 111 days to do that. Team of the week is there forever. Let's have a look. So the first one, signings stars. One to watch focuses on the performances of players at their new club. Buy free players off the transfer market. Standard. We can get that done today. Gold pack. Easy as you like it. One to watch player performances are tracked throughout the season. Score a goal using a player purchase from the transfer market in squad battle matches on a minimum semi pro difficulty or rivals. Again, standard. Then we've got one to watch players who receive a team of the week. Upgrade will also get a one to watch item stats upgrade. Score a goal using a player purchased from the transfer market and an assist with a player purchased from the transfer market in squad battle matches on semi pro or in rivals and finally in the finding form we've got score a goal in three separate wins using player purchased from the transfer market in squad battle matches again on semi pro or rivals so at the minimum you've got three games first off we're going to do this one because obviously at the moment we don't necessarily need to buy anybody of, of any importance we're going to look at this we're just going to go ahead and we're going to go goalkeeper Maybe not. Somebody had that same opinion. We're going to go goalkeeper. We're going to go CDM. Uh, okay. No, somebody else had that opinion. Let's go a little bit more then. Okay. So uh, Saudi Arabia. Perfect. And then finally, another goalkeeper because you never know. That is all you've got to do for that. 600 coins as a minimum if you've already bought people that for your team. And we get the gold pack done. So that is the first one done from that. We got a cheeky gold pack. And what you want to be doing then is basically just getting a striker, a cam, or so anybody who is going to be assisting and scoring in your team up front what i personally would suggest if you've got yourself a nice team and you're not looking to spend too many coins go and buy a gold striker whatever go play your squad battles hey we got a board from it if we take that who is it center mid hey we take his luis alberto 83 i done day so we get an 84 oh, we already have him so we've got an 83 from here beautiful that is untradeable obviously uh, and he's still untradeable fantastic so i would go ahead and go and buy a 500 1k coin striker slat or two strikers and then go ahead into squad battles and just go get that done very very easy free matches get your squad battle points up and you get yourself a 100k pack from it i personally you can do rivals but because you've got to score in a goal in three separate wins if you're already in division six division five seven eight then you're coming up against teams that are starting to progress and maybe you're not looking to buy somebody worth 100k to do this objective you don't want to necessarily have to really sweat out these wins and take longer than you can i'm just thinking you can go get your jumbo rare players pack as soon as possible go get them uh, matches done it's so simple so realistically what you want to be doing is it's just one goal so just one goal with that player that gets you the first one and if you get the assist in the same match game one done of all three and you get your first two objectives done here then two more matches all you have to do is score a goal score a goal with a player you've bought two more times you get yourself and you get a rare players pack as well wow i didn't even read that so a gold pack two players two rare and a rare players for that honestly cracking and also you will get this so make sure you're looking at this as well you will get extra bonuses for this also so if you want to go for a few more goals to get any of these done as well as then getting an extra free matches done for your 20 it's an absolute saving grace you get uh what a lone team of the week and i think that's a rare players so you basically get two two rare players a couple of two player packs a jumbo rare and a lone team of the week in just these two objectives i think it's a big dub honestly i am really happy with these objectives so far hopefully they do continue because these are warm-ups hopefully we do see them carry on through the year not necessarily have to be a 100k pack but at least giving us something else to do in the milestones once we have days where we've done everything all we've got is a richarlison to do and then we can focus on everything else and obviously silver beast also so let me know down below if you are going to be completing that and if you do who do you get so let me know down below make sure you like and subscribe on this and i'll see you all for Kessie's review coming up next. Peace.